Pastor Turner here, New Birth Ministries. Today is our two-minute drill, so let's listen to the voice of the Spirit, see if we can learn something today. don't have all day. I only have two minutes. So let's go to Luke, the 23rd chapter. And I want to read verse 34. We all love to talk about the seven last words from the cross. But there's one phrase that he said, one group of words that he said that I think we like to skip over a lot. And it says, Jesus said, Father, forgive them for they do not know what they are doing. In other words, he's saying, Father, forgive them for they are crazy. Or Father, forgive them because I think they are insane. And when I was thinking about this and reading this and just last night, it hit me sometimes when I do things that is beneath who God says that I am, it looks like that I'm insane sometimes. I'm crazy sometimes. And so when Jesus was in the court of appeals and he was talking to God the Father, like a good lawyer, he knew that he couldn't get us off because we were guilty. He knew that we are guilty. We are a fornicator. We lie. We steal. We backbite. We talk behind people's backs. So he knew that he couldn't get us off because we are, in fact, guilty. But any good lawyer, if they know that they can't get us off when we're guilty, they'll see if they can't plead insanity. Because if they can prove that we are insane sometimes, then instead of going to jail, they'll send us to treatment. I came to tell you that when he was on the cross, when he said, Father, forgive them for they are insane. I need you to send them to treatment and don't send them to hell. And I want you to know that when you're going through things, we serve a God that does not condemn us. We serve a God that can fix us through his word. He knew that we had a lot of shortcomings. He knew that he made a lot of mistakes, but his blood covers a multitude of sin. So I thank God that his blood can cover my insanity. That's my time.